Today's video, we got a good one. We got second place at YCS Pasadena piloting True Draco Sky Striker. Let's go. And also, friendly reminder, we only have 28 more. I am in Demian Cloth Playmat, so free shipping wherever you live. You could live in Toronto, you could live in Wakanda or Australia, it don't matter. Free shipping wherever you live. 45 USD for one player, 55 USD for two player. Get yours now, only 28 left before we sell out. So get yours now and enjoy second place Cody Angelo's deck profile. Let's go. Yo, what's up guys? Here we are with second place y YCS Pasadena, Cody Angelo with the YouTube hey, boys and Team Summer X1 here Jesus in theory. Uh, he go. is not <laughs> here, but here in theory. Yeah. Let's go, bro. Why don't you explain what deck you play? Because it's a spicy ass deck. Alright, so I play Draco Striker. Um, I think the deck is really good because against um, all the control decks, yeah. you, the Draco cards just kind of blow those out. And against more of the combo decks, the uh, Strikers actually like keep them at pace. Like, and with it, you, everything so was you easy, you just obliterated everyone, yeah? Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Okay, sick. Okay. Let's get straight uh, into your profile, bro. Alright, so for... Wait, before that, wait, bro, aren't you like a famous, like, streamer? I'm not famous, what? Like, <laughs> kind of the greatest streamer in the world, bro. What's your Twitch name? I'm... You actually do know? <laughs> Alright, so my Twitch name is twitch.tv Gooball Gaming. Six. If everyone's you... gonna go onto that right away, right? Alright, so... Yes, if, if you guys like edu educational... Twitch streamers, then I'm the guy. I'm hey, the guy. I. I see. I. In that case, everyone's gonna go to that, and now check out your profile. All right. So, since we're playing Draco Striker, we uh we have some Draco monsters. So this is really like unusual for a lot of the decks because a lot of, a lot of the decks that I've seen are playing on like two Ignis or even three, where I didn't really want to draw the Draco monsters. I really just wanted to search them. Like I don't. I don't like bricking on them, and they don't do anything in your opening hand. The only cards that really do anything, like Draco wise, in your opening hand is like Heritage that let you draw cards. So that's why I only played two. You wouldn't, you wouldn't make any of them higher than the one of each. No, like honestly, I, at one point, like this was cut. Oh wow, <laughs> that's very free. You're the master of the deck, bro. You know the best. Um. So next, we have two Ray. Uh, th this was at three whenever I was playing Desires, which I still think is correct. <laughs> um, but for this event, I played the Blue Boy Engine just because I thought that, uh, I really thought that Desires would, like, kind of mess me up in Top Cut. I didn't want to get, like, have that random variance to where, yeah. like, I just banish everything and not be able to play because of Desires. Right. So I just went with the safer option, even though, like, I think Desires is still better. <laughs> um, next, I played three hand traps in the main deck. Um, Why the bureau, bro? So... So Friday, Friday um, afternoon, right before I registered my deck list, I, I talked to uh, Johnny Lee, which is one of the main guys that like brought this deck to life. He like we uh, we theoried a lot up, um, up to this event, and we decided that if we played against like more of the combo decks, like Jesse's deck or like any of his crew is playing, we won't just like blow out cards, like unfair cards against him. Um, so that's why we play Neighbor. Like, this card, this card, uh, I don't know. Like, I, I only resolved it once and it was, like, really good. Yeah, it was yeah. against, uh, Pendulum. Hey. <laughs> Wait, and hey, Pendulum? What Pendulum. kind of bougie ass player were you playing, bro? You know, Jackal? <laughs> yo, yo, Pendulum, free, free is matchup. Uh, uh, free, uh, free uh, yo, free is matchup. Free is uh, matchup with this deck. Uh, he went free master, not Jackal. Free. <laughs> Alright. So, next, we play. The shitty engine, honestly, it's not even good. Play desires instead, please. Play please play desires. Screw instead. blue boy. I right. agree. These are the monsters. Not many. Um, next, we play three god card. Literally the best card in the game right now. Best uh, card that's been printed in the last three years. I agree. I agree. One hundred percent. This card is so dumb. Oh yeah, I agree. One hundred percent. I think it's better than electro. Uh, next, we play three area zero. I wanted to play two of this, but there's a lot of times where I like. Where like I'd open this kind of Draco spell, and then like start whiffing. So I just want to add more name, more uh, Sky Striker names to my deck, so that that wouldn't whiff as much. Um, next for the other three of us, we play three Shark. So <laughs> with um not having Anchor, we we actually need more ways to like push for damage. Yeah. So three Shark, 
Also, against Orcas, it's it's actually a really, like, hard matchup. Like, it feels like you're playing, like, behind all game. So, like, three strike actually helps with that. Especially if you can stop them from getting the battle. Yeah. Also, it lets you help push for game. Yeah. Um, next for the one of Sky Striker cards. Uh, all these are one of the weird ones, I guess. Um, are these? Yeah. yeah. So... I think this card is like another multi role. Then again, whenever I was playing Desires, like this is what makes Desires good. Like whenever I was playing it, yeah. so yeah. but this card is nice all weekend. This card though, um, I, I don't see anyone playing this card in the Draco like Sky Striker deck. But this card by itself like helps you win like and keep pace with like the uh, mirror match. And by mirror match, I mean like pure Sky Striker. Yeah. Um, it lets you not like fear. Your um, Imperm or uh, Valor, either, yeah, yeah. and a or, lot of people were trying to play Valor a lot too. And I didn't yeah. want to lose to that card turn one. Yeah. Um, that's all the Sky Striker cards. Pretty big lineup. I think it's 16 uh, Striker cards. Next for the Draco Engine, we uh we play a very small uh, spell. Like engine. a normal engine, or just like specifically just the one you decided to play? Uh, so. Like, a lot of people are playing two two or like three. Yeah, um, a lot of people are playing three disciples and three heritage. Like, so I don't think like you need three of them. Like, they're honestly breaks if you open them, yeah. unless you open them with like every zero. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like, I I just didn't want like, I always just wanted to search them pretty much. Yeah. I always wanted to also in case like I have to pop one. Yeah, yeah. Also, I don't need to talk about Tiger. I'm that card's insane. Yeah. <laughs> uh, next for the uh, spellbook cards. Uh, we went with two secrets, not three. Um, after you resolve the blue boy the first time, yeah, then yeah, it's just yeah, a dead yeah, card. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I, I sent like the second wall of multi roll and diagram so much today. Uh, next were the uh, generic spells. We just play terraforming, upstart, and s set rotation. Yeah, that card is Log fire. Card in this, deck, yeah. this is the best card in the deck. If you open this in a Draco spell, you go like plus. I think it's like plus five or six, just wow. from this and a Draco spell. This card's insane, honestly. Also, it makes it so you can't get even lead. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, and then for the traps, I played two Dirkan, only because, same reasoning as uh, Nibiru, where I didn't want to like play against the combo decks and not have anything for it. It wasn't really for Orcas, it was more like for the Thunder Dragon deck. Um, you just don't need them to make multiple Colossus, pretty much. Yeah. If they make multiple Colossus, then it's really, really hard to out. What was some, uh, some of your matchups like? Um, matchups, I played five or six Orcas, two Draco, two Pendulum, two Infernoid, <laughs> one, in, one Salad, and uh, one Striker Orcas. Okay, all right. Oh, and one Striker. Yeah. Well, I'm pretty sure there could be only one is good against all those decks you just said. Uh, yeah. yeah. And uh, I only play Apocalypse. Um, I covered turn right. because the same reason as uh, these. Like you never want to open idea. these cards. You just you just want to search them, honestly. Fair. Like, oh, you did just in second place, bro. You know best. I would play, I would play with turn, but I don't know anything about the deck. So how many cards are you playing? Uh, Thirty nine. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, next for the extra deck. For the striker cards, we play one Kagari, one Kaina, not two, two Hayate, not three, and three Shiz. Um, it's really hard to make room for that in the extra deck for like the other striker cards, honestly. Yeah. At least for me, it was because I I just felt like there's so much more like value like within the extra deck than what people thought. Yeah. Um, those are the striker links. I play Rashka. So in case I draw knowledge, then I can send it up, send it and draw two. Yeah. Um, also, it clears up your Draco cards. Yeah, Hida, uh, this card's insane. Phoenix, Unicorn, Negresu, probably the best card in my extra deck. Uh, Boral Sword, Dengresu, and the Spice from me. Oh, what the hell is this? <laughs> so for what you guys don't like, for everyone that doesn't know what this card does. Um, whenever it's destroyed by battle or a card effect, 
then you get to special summon a Link 2 or lower monster from your graveyard. Also, if your opponent has like a big monster on the build, it gains 200 for each Link monster in the graveyard. So like, you can just like throw all your Striker Links into the graveyard and just give this guy so much attack. It, com it comes up a lot, honestly. Uh, also, the only bad part about this card is like, if Area zero sins, so it doesn't trigger it. Right. But diagram, diagram destroys it, so it'll get the effect that way. Right, yeah. right. Nice, nice. That card, nice. Uh, and then for the side deck, probably the most interesting and hard, the hardest part about building the deck, honestly. Uh, the side deck is probably like, this is probably the hardest side deck I've ever had to build, honestly. Yeah. Just because I want to play so many different cards because there's so many different decks in the format right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. And like, I don't want to overside for them too. Yeah, yeah. Because I, as, whenever I was making the side deck, I had like 11 cards for Orcus when I only needed like six. And like, I just didn't know yeah. what to play. Yeah. But Johnny helped me out with it a lot. Uh, so we side one Ignis for whenever we go second. Um, Ignis really shines when going second whenever you open uh, Ignis and a uh, spell card. Oh, yeah. Or because yeah, you, can, yeah. Uh, you can fight through the back row, and then if they chain the back row, then you can just get another spell card. So you can get Heritage again and then draw two. Yeah. Uh, you so, can go the traps over too, just to get rid of a monster. Yeah, exactly. Like, just being able to break boards with this card yeah. is really nice. And, like, they can't respond where you just get yeah. uh, two draws for free. Yeah. Right. Uh, we play one crow. Um, one. This one, one off. Oh, you so this was weird. Oh, this uh, is beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so this was either this was either going to be a uh, mind control or crow. And last minute I decided it to be crow, just because I thought crow was better against the uh, combo thunder dragon matchup. Honestly, yeah. that's the only reason. It was the fifteenth card. I didn't really know what else to play. Uh, next three Lancio. Um, I, I don't know what there is to say about this card, except yeah. that it just skips your opponent's uh, turn. Yeah, screw this card. You activate this card, and you get to go first. Like, why would you not want to do also, that? Also, the coolest thing about this, not that you can use it yourself, but since you're playing Shark Cannon, if, well, they're not going to lance you you. I had this problem, I didn't play <laughs> Pendulum today, but I always just steal this from them, so that's all I did, but no one's lancing at you, but, yeah. Um, so, next, two Cosmic, not yeah. three. I already have enough back row removal in the deck. Um, yeah. But yeah, this card is good this weekend. Also, you can uh, chain like chain it to diagram and get yeah, free yeah, cards. Yeah, yeah. Uh, three dark Ruler no more. This is for a pendulum and thunder dragon. Uh, I was really scared of thunder dragon, honestly. Pendulum. Pendulum. He was very scared of pendulum too. Uh, no, yeah, that yeah, deck's yeah. free. Um, <laughs> oh thunder dragon was really scared though. It's scary though, because of, because like if they make two, then you just can't play. Yeah. Honestly, yeah. Uh, I saw this in like twice against the uh, two pendulum matchups I had. And it actually won me my top 32 match. Nice. Uh, next, Two Typhoon. Um, once again, uh, Pendulum's. Pendulum, if they go first, and like if you don't draw side deck cards, it's kind of hard to beat. But uh, this uh, this dealt with a uh, Secret Village. It, it deals right, with Secret yeah, yeah, Village, yeah. and it, it's also a hand trap against Pendulum. Yeah. So it's nice. Yeah. Uh, and then three impermanence. All right, that's all right. in the game. Nice, nice. Overall, bro, what would you, would you take anything to the deck? You just keep it as probably desires, right? Uh, who's play, who wants to play this deck? Yeah, uh, I play desires in this deck a lot. Like almost everyone disagrees with me, but I think desires is correct. I right, sick. Right. Any shout outs you want to give? Yeah, I have a ton of shout outs right. actually. So first off, I want to give a shout out to my boys back at home, um, Jay, Hudge, Ian, uh, all you guys. I appreciate you guys. You guys know I love you. Um, next, I want to give a shout out to uh, Luxury Gaming. Hey, nice, Luxury Gaming. Nice. Uh, Luxury uh, Finals, actually, for Pasadena, because of uh, this Mr. Uh, YCS yeah. champion over here. Uh, shout out to Kobe, obviously. It was a great match. Uh, he deserves the win more than me, in my opinion. Um, shout out to Hani, right here. Master Deck Builder, yeah. building YCS winning decks every event. Hey, nice, nice. Uh, shout outs to well, Justin. No Tripp. shout out for the Tommy. For Tommy. Oh, Tommy. <laughs> Yo, actually, shout out for Tommy. He he actually got me Starbucks so much. Let's hey. go. Uh, what about uh, any any uh, specific amazing group chat? Uh, yeah, actually, yeah. 
I guess. Shout out to Take Notes. I guess. I guess. Yo, Take Notes, best best group chat, honestly. Let's go. Like, three and top four. Like, I want to know one more you want. People are going to ask you invited, bro. Nah. Sorry. Exclusive only. Exclusive only. Sick. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for watching. See you next video. For those who made it to the end of the video, what's up? Well, how you doing? Friendly reminder to go pick up your I Am and D-Man cloth playmats right now before they sell out. 28 left in the description. See you in the next video. Peace.